I decided to go for it. I decided to give looking for an unreset 2010 server a shot. It's lucky that I did because I just so happened to find this, this server, the one that I'm making this video about. Mine uh, today we're returning to Novilan after like a year and a half. So this is the first time I've joined in probably a year and a half. And it looks like I'm like halfway through the parkour, which is interesting. So Q S M P and then we'll see where I'm at on the server. Oh yeah. Okay. So this is, this is the, I was, I was working on a museum. I believe last time I did something on here. I, I, I got some historic item donations and I was like working on a like cool little museum and then I just like kind of ran out of motivation but uh, I remember I was playing this with like a bunch a couple of my friends be like before uh, I made the video on the server like I started this base with some friends and we were just we were just doing this and I was like yeah this is like the oldest thing oh dude I have a bunch of original books uh, this was the uh, wheat farm that I, I built and it was like a so, sort of like Aztec temple inspired and I built a little wow like crap all right, uh, I'll, I'll do slash spawn now, and we can check out the new spawn because I do want every update. And it's uh, it's a little bit of FPS tanky, but it looks beautiful. We're just exploring. I'm just getting started. We just revving the engines of uh, of our tour guides and J tail right here, exploring. Yeah. yeah. So let's uh, let's let's move to the to the first place. So let's Probably get to the first show, place. How, do we uh, how we travel around now. Yes. Um, yes. So warps were removed. Um, I think in your interview, actually, uh, it was mm. mainly just because he hated commands, stuff like that. Yeah. So instead, uh, there's the Stargates, which I know have been on the server for a while, but uh, whenever you are online, they broke. They, yeah, they weren't uh, working. But, I remember. Yeah, that. but they were fixed. Uh, so basically, we just flick the lever, um, and there's a command. It's basically slash dial, and then the, lo the name of the location you want to visit. Okay. So I'll first do this, which is going to be Beta Town. We just go in here. Okay. All this is actually time. a town. Uh, that was started by a friend of mine named Boovler. Okay. Uh, yeah. This was started back around May of last year. Th this is a cursed stream now. We yeah, can't show this. Careful. We can't show this. I like this. I like this, like, uh, kind of like a blast from the past type of thing. Yeah. Uh, you can see a few houses from different members and stuff. I think, uh, yeah. Oh, someone I like mentioned bricks. Oh, you see this statue, by the way, over uh -huh. here? This is kind of yeah. like the. Landmark. I don't know if your view distance can see it or not. Oh wow. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna oh, just have my no, distance us. on just max. Wow. Okay, that <laughs> we were. I was missing out on a quite a view. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's like that. kind of like the landmark of this town. I can. Uh, I don't, that is so cool. Look at that. Um, I know this is a library here that was built oh, by XM. I, also, uh, I know also if you right-click books on here, uh, like bookshelves, it gives oh, like little yeah. prompts and stuff. Oh, oh, I just, okay, well, it's, a family is a unit composed of not only children, but of man, woman, and occasional animal, and the common cold. Uh, in this area that we're staying in right now, it's actually the first area where, like, the town started. Oh, uh, I like it, it's a good area. It's basically where they first started building, uh, oh, this and really this cool. tower is Echo Pizza's tower, so it's the first ever mm -hmm. tower that was built in this part of the town. Oh, here's our police department right here. Yeah, this is a house I made whenever I joined the town. Oh, dude, the pistons uh, as a, this is a good idea. I yes. love that. That's a good use of pistons. He, he says he jumps through them every time he goes to a build. Let's see if he does it. Yo, yeah, you did the thing again. Go. You did the same. Yep. Oh, I was, I was prepping myself for disappointment and then I get to go through again. Dude, this is amazing. So yeah, this is a uh, copper village. This is a town uh, that was built by break stuff. This is actually a pretty impressive town. Um, it was built in August of 2022 and I know he found Found, uh, like a big copper statue that was built by a moderator. This is really this, high detail. This is actually sort of lagging me. Oh, there's that like the Golden Gate Bridge or something over there. And over here, uh, oh, you see that big statue over there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think that was actually built by a moderator. Oh. And uh, he kind of found this town and built around it. Oh, I love I think that's also why it's called Copper Village. This is actually so cool. Dude, this is a cool, before I play, open that up, this is a really cool map. Let's like uh, get a look at that. That is so, there's so many builds around here. You can't even fit them all on the screen. And yeah, I think he started expanding in uh, March, 2023 is when I started expanding. You can see a bunch of houses here by different members. I, th I think like, each house is gonna have uh, someone who owns it. Uh, I gotta say this tour is kind of helpful for me. I haven't gotten to see most of this. I'm, I'm glad that it's uh, <laughs> that it's helping. People have built a huge amount of stuff in the past two years. That I believe that. Oh, this really is a cool. uh, frog's house right here. Oh, all right. There we go. First on frogs, home. 
dude, it's a jo Oh, so you're the one who's been making this, like, statue everywhere. What, is this a frog? I'm guessing this is a frog. And I know there's a, a certain area that he, that was here, like, before he built the village. And, uh, he kind of surrounded it. I don't know where it is, though, but... I know there's also this house here, too, which was here, uh, before the village was built. Alright, so we'll go to this area. And this is gonna be Cthulhu land. Cthulhu. Uh, this... This was uh, built by uh, Hero Super Dylan. He would have joined us on a tour, but I think he uh, had to go to bed. But oh, this is okay. his town. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, looks like yeah, we can yeah. also fly here too. Oh, is this flying? Oh, yo. Yeah, that, oh, th this should cool. make traveling around much easier. Yeah, and, and maybe I'll be able to avoid all of these thousands of creatures <laughs> that have just spawned. And the rain, dude. Yeah, so uh, oh my God. <laughs> it just got struck by lightning in front of me, man. But uh, this is a town that. Uh, I think to become a member of it, you actually have to uh, sacrifice yourself because oh, really? it's kind of like a cult cultish sort of town. Oh, um, really? So it's basically like a town just dedicated to uh, Cthulhu, basically. Really? Um, oh, Is and, that, that why and that's why. Squids? Yeah. <laughs> that's just so. Happened. I, I think like the first thing that was like built in this town was basically this fountain and the pathways, and this uh, fountain here is kind of what inspired the name. Uh, or kind of what inspired the cult, I guess. Plus because, the name. Because it, the squids just spawn constantly on it? Yeah, basically. Really? They're just like, hey, let's oh, just... Oh, yeah, it's it, it, it just says some, some stuff in Cthulhu language. But I know whenever you join this town, I have to become a member. Mm -hmm. You'll do a sacrifice in... Where are you? Yeah, uh, there you are. Uh, yeah, you in have a this area. So like, yeah, so the stage, basically. Uh, you have to uh, put your, like... Uh, you have to, like, set your spawn, put yourself in a chest, and then uh, you just go here oh, and, they got map and jump into lava. Oh, these guys. <laughs> I know, they're everywhere. And right over here, there's also a uh, a graveyard. We're just going to have like graveyard. the names of like every member uh, who's part of the town. Okay, Basically, see. everyone who gets sacrificed for this town, their name gets put into uh, the graveyard. Along oh, with like the date okay. whenever they were sacrificed. And I think their goal is like uh, a thousand people. I, really? I think I think that's what their goal is for this graveyard. I know I also have a Wait, yeah, sign so around here somewhere. 2022. So this started pretty like early on, actually, like after mm -hmm. the revival, basically. Looks like they even got moderators in here. Here's a uh, Riley's Castles sign. Oh yeah, yeah. So, yeah, and some people apparently have more decorated signs than others. Oh, egg knob is here too. Wolf dragon. I don't know why I just want to look at all these. Whoa, this is cool. Whose is this? <laughs> what is this? Just I'll a be... stack of every block in Minecraft. Or close to every block in Minecraft? Close, man. Probably. Yeah, stream was, was today. Uh, Hello. Oh, dude, someone knew I was going to go to the top of this? What? That is crazy. Oh. Oh, look at that. That's a big-ass castle, and that's an even bigger space, like, futuristic design house or something. Okay. Mm. Welcome so. to Retroville. Oh, I can see a pixel art Pikachu. Oh, this is this is also feeling retro. Yeah, this is uh, Retroville. It was founded on June 12th, uh, 2021, actually, after Ooh. whenever you and Mr. Epic uh, came on the server. That's oh, when okay. they uh, started this. And it was started by a person called That's Very Sad and Zero underscore ED, whose name is now non -Pop Bob, which uh, they actually not, have a house here. Not Pop Bob. So That's Very Sad started playing Minecraft in like 2011. And wanted to make a town now it's like kind of reminiscent of the alpha and beta versions of minecraft so uh i started building this town um they mostly like winged winged doing it first with uh first like starting to build up a few sections of the roads and building houses around that yeah and then after that they basically started inviting a couple more players to build houses with them whoa 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 pook town what is that pook town <laughs> How did I not notice this? This is crazy. This is like Pooktown oil, oil. That's whoa, whoa, and these banners, dude. Hey, there's an entire map art right here too. Oh no, wait, hold up. Is that a map art or a? Where is that? Where is that map art? <laughs> How many? Is there? Does somebody have like a whole? Uh, whoa, whoa. There's just a hole in the ground. Woo, whoa. Okay, I'm excited to check that in a second. But I, I'm sorry, Pooktown just like. Why is it called Pooktown? <laughs> Oh, yo, this is like, this is crazy. This is like the the Japanese-inspired one, I guess, right? Yeah, this yeah, one's, yeah. uh... Actually, it, this is still, like, gone. Is this... Gone oh, I, it, wait, let me guess. Does that guy watch anime? <laughs> Most likely. Does he watch Hunter x Hunter? Is that why he's called Gone? 
I know I know he started it at the end of like April of 2023. Oh, is this, is this Jap Japan inspired or Chinese inspired? Yeah, it's uh feudal Japanese. Uh, Japan style. Okay, okay, okay. This is oh, and he's got it all labeled. How do you label it? I think you like oh, yeah. oh, whoa, look at this. Shops are not, currently not maintained, but look at that. Look at that sign. I didn't even know you could do that. That's crazy cool. Oh, look at this. I I like this. This this is cool, these uh, aesthetic modifications to your armor. That's actually neat. I like that. Whoa! What? What? Yeah, this is what? Not what? Back to Does that go down to bedrock? I am lagging. I am lagging. I am... I am lagging. Holy. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, it's it's a huge base. I think when Della okay. built this last year, after they uh, got burnt out trying to model their 2010 base, uh, so then they built this to like kind of start fresh. This is and like I got burned out of Minecraft. They build this. Yeah. Holy and every crap. everything underground, uh, everything underground here is Wendella's, and okay. up top is uh, some other houses and stuff built by other players. Okay. Yeah, well, it's like, uh, well, about... kind of like a community base. This is a community project. That is I'm pretty nuts. sure. Yeah. That is nuts. What is this robot? This this was built by uh, Entropy, right? Oh, I think so. Yeah. Holy, is that like a Star Trek meets Portal? Oh my God. <laughs> I want to see what what project burnt them out. Then, like, what is this 2010 <laughs> base that got the burnt out of Minecraft? Holy crap! It is. What is this? this oh, it's it, oh, it's a computer. I'm not reading really anything. I pressed one, and we're gonna do one plus one. All right, one, and then how do I one add plus? Seven. Plus. Um, I actually have to reset it first before doing. But. Who built this? Who built this? Uh, this was built uh, by Jinx GP. Uh, Jinx, and yeah. It was built in January 2022. Uh, wow. I think the design is uh from a YouTuber named Matt Batwings. Um, and what it told me basically is uh they imported it using a schematic uh. Like they imported a schematic using Lightmatica, yeah. and it just shows a random spot in the ocean. Uh, and I also like dug out a huge quarry uh, to get like, a good chunk of the materials, like stone, redstone. I'm actually about to die from these phantoms. Yeah, <laughs> I'm on one heart. Ah, oh, I died. Oh, oh no! Where? So this... inspired by the, the Kowloon city. Yeah, the walled city. That was. I dude, I made a, a build on one of my servers that was inspired by that. Um... I think this is all in four chunks. If I'm not. Mistaken. I like that they went yeah, super then, small. I always made it slightly too big, and then people uh, never built in it. Oh, they built. Build, build, build your home, house. someone else's home. Translated by uh, Cantonese Kowloon IRL. This gets more crazy the further up you get. We're, That's nuts. Like, we're pretty high up on the on the Dude, I remember um, Kowloon. I I uh, I was a, I, there was like a CBC documentary or like radio documentary about it that was happening and that I watched, I listened to because it was on radio. And that was what like sparked my interest in the Kowloon walled city. Oh, here yeah. Wow, this really goes higher and higher up, doesn't it? There, there, there we go, we're on the highest point. You're not permitted to leave was... the area. I can't even leave. Yeah, that, yeah that's, that's why I use it in the It's pretty cool. It really is. This and it's like super detailed and compact. Like This is what I'm talking, it feels, you know, huge because there's just so much. Whoa. Oh, oh yeah. What this is this? Is a, <laughs> Holy! Yeah, Uzi did in chat before that um, a guy called Take Your Shirt. He built a garden in the end, and then they uh, they pasted it into the uh, overworld. Then he oh. rebuilt it. Whoa! Okay, I need I to go to the top of this first. This is beautiful, though. This is gorgeous. This was built by like Take Your Shirt, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Take Your Shirt. Uh, I actually remember <laughs> because uh, I remember seeing videos. Uh, he used to be a map maker uh, a few years ago for like uh, Xbox 360. Really? And like I know he, I know he made maps for like a uh, Stampy, Stampy Longnose. Oh, uh, really? Did he? Like yeah, I mean, like if you guys, you. if you guys know the map of uh, Stampy's Paradise, uh, Sa oh Stampy yeah, yeah, map. yeah, he built that map. Mm. Oh wow, very cool. cool. Whoa! Uh, Giant Lines built a lot of like crazy builds, even like the Whoa. public. Um, he built the public uh, village of trading hall, and it looks unbelievable. I yeah. Whoa. Yeah, he's like, uh, I think he's actually a second richest player on here. But yeah, this space, I think, was built by Giant, Ali Giant Lion, and then, like, uh, all the resources uh, were given to him by other players. That's and crazy. I think he has a line somewhere that says uh, who gave him all the materials. This is crazy, though. I mean, like, I if I built this in Minecraft, I'd be happy to never play the game again. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is... 
These are all, uh, Quartz Machine is what he has the villagers labeled as. All right, well, I think this is the, this has been a really good stream. Thank you everybody for, uh, for watching. I appreciate you popping by. I appreciate this tour. Yeah, right. thank you everyone. And uh, I'm in the stream now. Three.